Solver, a powerful what-if analysis tool. Solver is an advanced what-if analysis tool of spreadsheet applications. It is used to find out the best optimized results out of the data set while considering any constraints also. For example, you may want to find out what will be the minimum monthly expenses considering various conditions of expenses. Let us understand how Solver works with a simple example. This data set is showing three items, chairs, tables and sofas. For each of these three types, the number of items made in a day are given in column B chairs, 18, tables 3 and 12 sofas. Their cost prices, 1000, 7000 and 15000 are given in column C respectively. Column D shows their expenses number produced in the cost price. See the total expenses? That is, 2,19,000. The manufacturer wants to know what will be the minimum expenses if daily, 40 chairs, 20 tables and 30 sofas are produced or manufactured. But there are certain conditions or constraints also. See cell B7. 100 is the daily production capacity. The manufacturer wants to maintain this capacity. That means, the total number of items manufactured daily should not fall below 100. Well, this is the first constraint. And, what are the other three constraints? We have already seen them. Daily, 40 chairs, 20 tables and 30 sofas to be manufactured. So, the objective is to find out minimum expenses to achieve capacity of manufacturing 100 items while making 40 chairs, 20 tables and 30 sofas daily. Let us see. How we do this using Solver? Let us first mark the cells from which we need the values. Cell D5 is the objective cell. Minimized expenses. The changing values in the data set are the number of items manufactured. These are cells B2 to B4. These are our changing variable cells. The constraint cells for four constraints are respectively B2 greater than or equal to 40 units. B3 greater than or equal to 20 units b4 greater than or equal to 30 units and the maximum capacity that is 100 in cell b5 let us see how we apply these in solver if you have solver add-in installed then you will find the solver option in analyze group under data tab click on it this is Solver Parameters dialog box. Where is our objective? Cell D5. So, we put the address D5 like this. Then, we select minimum here because we need to minimize the manufacturing expenses. Here, we select Cell range P2 to B5 as changing variable cells. Now, let us add the four constraints one by one. Here, click on Add button. Add constraint dialog box will pop up. In cell reference, mention cell B2. In comparison drop down, take greater than equal to, and, in constraint value, mention 40. Then, click on add button. Let us repeat these steps for adding remaining three constraints. Now, our parameters are ready. Let us click on the solve button. And, here we are. See what solver is suggesting? 
solver is suggesting that if we manufacture 50 chairs, 20 tables and 30 sofas, that is total 100 units in a day, then, minimum expenses will be 6 lakh 30,000 rupees. You can keep the solver suggestion if it suits you or, cancel it. This is how, optimized outputs are generated by solver tool by manipulating changing variables while considering all the constraints. To get solver add-in, go to the file tab. In the file tab, click on, options. Excel options dialog box will open. In this dialog box, go to add-in section. Add-in section shows the list of all the add-ins. From the list of add-ins, select Solver Add-in. And in Manage, click on Go button. If Solver Add-in is not added first, it will show the Solver Add-in checkbox unselected. So, select the checkbox. And, click OK button. When you come back to the Excel interface, you will find the Solver option in the Analyze group under Data tab.